this has been a perennial challenge you know every time we want to decide on candidates we want to see more women but I just a thought just occurred to me that we could if we get the necessary majority this coming election we could impose a quota for the upper house that they must comprise of no less than 30% women as senators to begin with. I would, I would love to see this proposal to go through. That's why I hope we get a strong mandate at this election. Uh, it'll be good. We can start with women who will be appointed as senators and they can show their leadership skills there at the upper house. That would be good. The Prime Minister was speaking at the Women in Politics Kuala Lumpur 2017 International Conference in Kuala Lumpur. Also present were Deputy Prime Minister Datu Sri Ahmad Zahid Hamidi and Amno Wanita Chief Tan Sri Sharizat Abdul Jalil. Datu Sri Najib also said it is vital for women to be seen and accepted as equal partners and drivers of growth for the nation. He said this view should be shared by all citizens as the government looks forward and initiates plans for the future with the National Transformation 2050 TN50 initiative. I want to see more, many more women entrepreneurs of all generations who will follow in the footsteps of these successful women. And I'm sure that there will be many among the first 10,000 entrepreneurs to be registered with Alibaba e-commerce platform. Datuk Sri Najib also paid tribute to Wanita Amno, saying that Amno itself has long relied on its women's wing for maintaining grassroots relationships, particularly in the rural areas. The conference has participants from 18 countries, representing 27 political parties and four international organizations.